So hey guys, welcome back to my channel for tutorials. So guys, today I'll teach you new style of soft body animation without using any third party add-on. Guys, it's really simple and best tutorial for beginners. So see guys, that's my really cool animation. And guys, now I teach you how I create this type of effect. So firstly guys, select your all assets and press delete key. So guys, now I'm going to take a plane and plane size increase. So guys, scale size 20, so press S letter and 20. Yeah, see guys, that's my scale size 20. And guys, next one, I take torus. So, guys, I increase this radius like a 0 0.5. Yeah, simple. And guys, go to an up like this. See guys, that's my z axis. I like 3 is good. And right click shade smoother. Yeah. And now, guys, go to on here. And guys, I apply a subdivision surface for more smoothness. Yes. And guys, level, I like 2 and 2, right? Okay, so guys, next one, I apply material. Guys, I already create materials. So guys, go to on file and append. So guys, I have material file. So select and guys, see, that's my material file. So guys, go to on material here and select material and append. Yeah, so guys, select your plane and go to on here and I apply background material. So click on here. Yes, and select your torus and apply like a gold material, a shiny gold. That's my rose gold material, right? Guys, you can download this material file from my website. It's free. Okay, so guys, next one, I apply some effect. So guys, go to on here and see guys, that's my cloth and collision. So guys, cloth check and collision check. Yes. Okay, so guys, go to on here. That's my cloth and guys, now select this one. That's my pressure. And pressure I like one like this and see guys that's my catchy guys and catchy I like 500 yeah and guys go to down and collision guys quality I like five and self collision check guys see that's my self collision I like one that's my friction decrease friction I like one and guys you can take two is depending on your work for my case but I like one and guys see that's my collision so guys see that's my friction i like two is good yeah that's it guys right that's my simple effect okay so guys next one i apply spare this one uv spare yeah guys don't change anything so guys go to an off like this and guys click on here i like z axis i like six is good and guys now i apply subdivision surface and guys now before subdivision surface guys i apply material so guys right click shade smoother and select guys go to on here and apply material like this yeah guys press one and guys click on here i apply rose gold actually marble material on second half so guys go to on edit mode and select guys select this one yes and guys click on here and i apply marble material and assign check yeah that's it guys and click on here and object yes see guys that's my simple material it's looking really good right okay so guys same i apply this time cloth and collision effect so guys select and guys go to on here cloth and collision check and guys same setting but guys i increase pressure so select pressure i like two this time Select this pair and pressure two, and guys, and I like 500. And guys, go to on here collision, same five. And guys, self collision check. And guys, see the friction, I like one. And guys, see that's my collision. And collision friction, I like two. Yeah, that's it, guys. Right, see that's my simple setting. And now, guys, click on here. And guys, I apply this term subdivision surface. Subdivision surface like this and two yeah see guys firstly i apply cloth collision and sec third one subdivision surface and guys select your torus 
and guys subdivision surface go to one last yes see guys the atmac cloth collision and subdivision surface right and guys now go to back and preview check yes right see guys that's my dynamic effect and now guys select your plane and go to on here collision check and see guys that's my friction i like two yes so guys one more time go to back and preview check yes see guys that's my simple soft body animation it's really good yeah right okay so guys now i apply more objects more count so guys firstly select your torus and guys go to on here and i apply array effect and guys count i like 12 is good and guys factor 0 and z1 up i like uh, increase like a 6 is good yes see guys that's my objects right guys you can increase more counts is depend your system configuration okay so guys now select this one that's my sphere and apply same array and guys count i like 12 and factor and guys go to an up so guys i like 3 yes see guys that's my composition okay so guys all is good and guys this time go to our here array and apply yes guys i create individually and guys i create new collection to drag and drop and one more time new collection drag and drop yes see guys that's my two collection okay so guys select your torus and guys i apply this one array and guys now i upgrade loose part so guys go to one edit mode yes and guys edit mode and press p and loose part check yes right see guys that's my all torus right see that's my all torus and guys now go to one spare and the same guys array apply and guys edit mode select all press a letter select all see guys that's my all selection shortcut command is press a and guys now press p that's my loose part check see that's my loose part check yes that's it guys and go to an object mode yeah see guys that's my loose part and guys now go to back and preview check guys is take lots of time we got that's my heavy effect so guys stop and guys go to back and select first spare and guys go to on here go to down and see guys that's my bake or dynamic check guys see that's my baking guys now i little bit change gravity so guys go to on here and see guys that's my gravity and see guys that's my default gravity minus 9.8 and guys i change like a minus 7 minus 7 decrease gravity and guys also i apply turbulence so guys go to add and i apply turbulence like this yeah and guys radius increase actually more yeah see guys that's my radius is good and guys select this turbulence so guys go to on here and strength i like 50 actually 60 is good and change seed randomly change seed like a 60 is good for me 60 yeah that's it guys right so guys that's my simple composition is good and i apply all effectors so guys now select your spare and go to on catch a and bake all dynamic check okay so guys now you can also increase this end frame because i create 500 frames so use 500 okay so guys my baking is finished now so guys go to here and preview check yeah see guys that's my really cool soft body animation it's looking really good right it's really smooth okay so guys now stop and guys i take camera so stop see guys that's my really cool effect and guys i take camera and set your camera angle so guys select your camera and guys like a 90 0 and minus 90 enter and guys go to back so guys that's my frame like a tree is good so guys more back yes good see guys that's my composition and guys select your background this one plane 
and go to our edit mode so so guys select and select your this one edge press e and g so guys go to an up like this and select so guys this time i apply bevel effect bevel and guys like amount is one point actually 0.15 and segment like a 40 yeah and object mode and right click shade smoother yes and go to one camera yes see guys that's my simple composition and now guys i apply lighting so guys click on here and guys color use environment texture chat and open guys i have hdri image so select and import yeah and lastly guys i apply light so guys i use area light and go to an up like this guys more and guys i increase screen size like a 5 is good so guys power like a 150 yes see guys that's a simple composition and guys press 0 so guys click on here render setting i use cycle render and divide gpu check and guys max amp i like 256 is good and enter and see guys that's my frame rate i like 30 fps and output so guys create new folder so guys go to a desktop and create new folder like this and then we take file name and guys see that's my file format png is good for me and guys i show you my one frame render yeah see guys that's my render okay so guys now little bit change as dr texture so guys close and guys go to one shading so guys go to one world property here and guys i see that's my sdr so press control t and now guys i change rotation like a 90 enter and one more time render preview yeah much better see guys that's my beautiful lighting and beautiful animation right okay so guys my final work is finished now guys lastly one more time go to back and see guys that's my end frame i like 500 and guys enter Yes, that's it, guys. Okay, so guys, select your sphere and guys click on here, catch it, and delete all dynamic check. Delete and one more time, guys, make all dynamic check. Yes. Okay, so guys, that's it. My final work is finished. So guys, if you like my video, please share and please subscribe my YouTube channel. And guys, you can download this project file material from my website. It's free. Thank you.